All right, so for this lesson, we're going to be doing dresser, but we're going to be doing two different dressers. Um, one is going to be a small one, and the next one's going to be a little bit larger. So how we're going to do this is we're going to build similar to the ones that we did this, but we're going to build the back one first before the, the front one. All right, so first thing we want to do is we are going to draw, you know what, let's make this the larger dresser. All right make this a little bit high there we go so we're going to start off with a tall dresser how we do this is we take this and connect it back to the vanishing point okay this is going to go against the back wall because that's how i want it to fit it's going to go to this wall if to this point if you want to move it down that's fine you can draw that back line however you want it's going to go straight up and now it's tucked in the back wall Okay, now to make drawers, there is a very simple way that you can do this. What you would do is you line it up straight here. You draw the sides of your doors. Okay, you see how they're all? And now all I'm going to do is I'm going to connect each one slowly going through. Okay, all the way through. down it. Now for you, I am um, fine that you just do three drawers, but at least you kind of get the idea of what it's going to look like if you have multiple doors. Okay, see how that's working? Oh, this is a bumpy ruler. <laughs> it's not your eyes tricking you. I guess I can't do it on that side. All right, good to know. Okay, so we have these straight lines, then all you have to do is put straight line back here. Okay. Remember the front line must be parallel with that one. All right. So we've got a little doorknobs on. We have a tall dresser. Let's do a small one. Okay. So we're going to start off with, oh, there we go. A small rectangle. Okay. There we are. And we're going to connect it back to the vanishing point. And this one's going to fit right in front. Okay, I'm going to go up and over, okay. Now this one we're just going to put one door in, which is fine. Um, one straight, one down, and we're going to connect it to the vanishing point, okay. There we are. Now if we wanted to, we could do up and down like this, okay, and kind of create a cross. One, two, three, four, that would be four. Now, we, right here, most times when we have something like this, there is a mirror. You can create a straight line up, okay? This would be the height. We go back, this corner, you come up. Then you have your mirror. How we get that illusion of a mirror is inside, we just kind of create like a little buffer, okay? and you can kind of like scratch it out all right that is absolutely fine you don't like the square you can go in and curve the sides a little bit all right this is for anything after you've drawn it you can give soft curves okay all right so those are two different dressers that you can use um for your project